was thinking about uh, yeah, practical applications for uh, jewel thieves and uh, I was having a look at this uh, this is a garden uh, light uh, if I was to switch it on there I got this from Poundman it cost uh, a quid if I cover up the uh, solar panel it lights up if I don't it doesn't and okay I was thinking well I think this is a jewel thief in operation so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, take it apart have a look what it's made of well like I say I, uh, I got it from Poundland so I bought uh, three or four of these and uh, this is a uh, complete unit uh, this is a unit of which uh, I've stripped down just to the solar cell and uh, we're getting uh, about 2.2 2 volts off it now uh, if I was to turn that over uh, I think you'd find we're getting 2.733 volts off that there now uh, if I was to move this lamp you can get a decent 3 volts off that which is good but we're basically under ambient light we're getting about 2.4 volts so we could probably charge about 2 AA batteries off that so uh, I'm just going to remove this to one side now and then uh, open up the actual uh, what's inside to show you uh, how it's a jewel thief so uh, I'll do that now there are three screws round here uh, of which I'm going to undo there's a switch there and an LED of which okay, we can uh, always uh, desolder and use on other applications if we was just to use this as a solar cell so uh, I'm going to undo them now, so you can see what's inside. I've taken them in three screws out now. The, uh, I'm just going to try and force this apart now. And uh, you'll notice that uh, you've got your solar cell, which is exactly the same as the solar cell that I showed you earlier. Now, uh, you know that you can get at least 2.5 volts off that, or three if it's under nice direct sunlight, and then. The interesting thing is we've got like a, uh, I do believe it's a, a 4 or a 5A battery, of which, if we were to pull that out there, it must be rechargeable, and like, uh, apart from that, we've got uh, a little bit of a circuit board, of which, I think that has got a uh, coil in it in some way to uh, ramp the volt voltage up. Now uh, I'm just going to take a circuit board off here to see what's inside. Now I've taken the, uh, the actual black clay casing off, uh, the LED is exposed and we can see that there is definitely a, a coil there so uh, if you can see it properly on the camera but uh, it looks exactly like a jewel thief circuit first to switch this on because the uh, light there is uh, dim you'll see that it's come on but also uh, if you give it too much light it comes on as well uh, but only if it switched off that was it wasn't it there you go so that's 
system it's switched off it's dumping the light through the LED whereas uh, if we switch it on again it's dumping all of the light through the battery now I found it's quite interesting that uh, this technology is being used all the time it's just we don't know about it so uh, what I'm going to do is hook this up to the oscilloscope so we can all see what it looks like and I think we'll all find it looks exactly the same as a jewel thief so we'll do that now done now is I've uh, hooked up one side of the oscilloscope probe to the inductor where it meets the LED and the other side to the negative for the battery and we're getting a steady nothing now uh, this circuit actually switches on when uh, we make sure that uh, there's no light coming on to that so uh, you just have to take word for it now that uh, when I put my hand over it now you'll start to see little pulses you see the pulses coming through and it's exactly the same way that you're going to get a pulse coming through on a jewel thief circuit which is quite interesting so uh, this technology is already out there it's just uh, it's not very well uh, tried this with uh, instead of having this here uh, I've tried tried it with my uh, super cap and uh, it works brilliant and like uh, charges up all day and it will discharge all night which makes that uh, really efficient I think because like uh, as long as it's in the light uh, you've got uh, light all night with it that's great then and uh, thanks for watching